So in today's project, we're going to go from this to this. Probably because going from this to this doesn't work. So, hope you like the project. Now I know this pattern is going to be under 24 inches. So what I've done is I've cut this piece of MDF to a 24 inch by 24 inch square. Next I print in my pattern, which happens to take up nine pages. So I'm going to go ahead and spread those out, and I'm going to cut them and tape them together. Now that I've got the pattern all taped up and put together, what I'm going to do is spray adhesive and some packing tape and get it put onto this MDF. Now that I've got the pattern attached to the MDF, there's the fun part, cutting it out on the scroll saw. Now that we have it cut out, we're going to size up our pallet, wood, we're not going to need that piece. So we want to get a pattern position on the boards how we want it. Then I'm going to take a marker and trace. Now we have the template for the pallet pieces. I went ahead and stacked the pallet wood in order. This is the first piece we're going to cut. At this point, we're going to start gluing and nailing these pieces on. Because this is going to be outside, what I'm going to do is go ahead and give it a bath in a uh, water sealer. There we go. Poodle to pallet. Hope you enjoyed the project. Hope it gave you some ideas of things that you can make. Um, you know, it doesn't have to be a poodle. It could be pretty much anything. So, again, hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for coming by. Make sure to, you know, subscribe, like, share, all that kind of stuff. And uh, we'll see you next time. Tim and Tim's Woodworking is not responsible for your safety and attempting to recreate this or any other project. It is the responsibility of the person or persons who are using any tool to read, understand, and follow the manufacturer safety guidelines. It is also the responsibility to use common sense. If you suffer from a lack of common sense, it is suggested you do not attempt this or any other project. If you attempt to recreate this project, your outcome and experience is made different from what has been seen in this video. Disappointments in the outcome of this or similar project is not the responsibility of Tim's Woodworking, as Tim is not a professional and we're not even sure he knows what he's doing. However, if your project is complete success, Tim's Woodworking should be given full credit for all of your successes. This project is void where prohibited by your spouse, girlfriend, or boyfriend, parents, grandparents, children, siblings, cousins, aunts, uncles, doctors, pets, and or neighbors. Tim and Tim's Woodworking, along with all the voices and content, we'd like to thank you for watching this and all the other videos on this channel. It is the responsibility of the viewer to click the like button as well as leaving comments and subscribing. Sharing is also suggested and appreciated.